Hi guys, it's Kaylee and, and it's Heather. Welcome back to our channel. Today we are enjoying the beautiful nice day and the sun's actually quite warm. What are you making faces for? <laughs> no. So today we are here to open the Universe Bound Book Club. So this was kindly sent to me by this company to review on our channel. So let's open it up. We cut it but we didn't take anything out of it. So, I have an envelope, and look at that seal. That's beautiful. Oh, wait, I want to smell the envelope. It smells like bath products. Yeah, so you can just smell the things. So, but look at that, guys. Look at that beautiful seal. Isn't that something? My phone doesn't have the sneak peek. Oh, up further. And there's the sneak peek into our box. So, I don't want to ruin the label, because... It's very pretty. I'm wondering what it looks like. It's a J. His name is James, but I don't think he do it with for his name. So just bear with me, guys. Um, if there's a background noise, we apologize. Um, when we come outside, everybody come out, and now it seems like there's people letting dogs out in places they shouldn't be. So inside here, we have. One, two, three. three. So I'm we have one. We have this universe bound experience book, Mark. Look at the other side. And then this side, Kaylee. No. Go ahead, show that one. Okay, then we have this universe universal bound experience one. Look how look how cute that is. Yep. And then there's another one that says Imagine Explore Experience. I think he likes cats. And Imagine Explore Experience on that side. So, very gorgeous. Like this, this one. I want that one. This one's my favorite because I love kitty cats that look like that. Same. Okay, so here is a letter. And this. Nope, don't look at that. This is everything that's in it. So, we'll go through this. No, this, there's a second page though. That doesn't say everything. Yeah, we'll go through this afterwards. It's got information in it. So the very first thing we're pulling out is Universal yeah. Bound Tea. Remember you gotta show up. Okay, open it up. So we'll open it all up and then I'll tell you guys how it's once Once well, I start using it, I'll tell no, you. No. Once um it's all opened up, we'll go over the info and read the descriptions of everything. <laughs> Strong. So this is called just experience tea. There's no name. I love tea, but I'm not a tea. I'm not ex I can't, tea person. I can't tell you what it smells like, so we'll let you know what that is. So the next thing we're bringing out is a little jar, which is it, cute. I think it has like um, raisins or something. No, these are called um, rock candies. I'm pretty sure. I want to try one. No, we're gonna make sure because it smells kind of flowery. So. No, those are rocks. We'll uh, let you know whatever this is. Ooh. It's soap bar. That's pretty. It's a loofah with some jelly soap into it. Oh my What's God. it smell like? It smells so good. Stop saying God, please. Sorry. Mmm. Can't really smell that, but we'll we'll get into it. Just pick out your hand. So the next thing I have it's is this beautiful candle, and they make their own. Universal Bound, and I'm pretty sure they're always soy. So it just says Universe Bound Candle Experience Candle. And oh, it's two tone. Oh, it's wow, it's two tone, but then it's got things on the top of it too. I should have kept that nice. Wow, take that off my fingers, please. Move it. Here. Oh, wow, guys, look at that. The top of it, and they use the wood wicks. Okay. So you got the purple. And then you got that brownie blue. color. It's blue. Well, it's blue on this side, but my side's purple. Oh, yeah. And then whatever that brown stuff is. Smells really, really nice. So we'll let you know what that is. Okay, my room. Something else. No, get that. No. You do the. So what's that? It's a basketball. Okay, we'll show it. So what's is anything on the top of it? What's it smell like? I can't tell. 
So they make um, all their bath bombs by hand too, like, like a company. Um, the last one I had was, I don't know if it was a tea one or a coffee one, but it was something. Um, I haven't used it yet because I forgot where I put it. I think that's a tea one. But we'll, we'll go over the, in a minute what it is. So this next is um, tea bags. So because where that's loose tea, mm -hmm. he gave um, tea bags so that she can make her tea, which is nice. I'm the only tea drink. I'm Just, is that anything? I guess it. I guess it'll hurt. It's not what I'm looking at. I want to see. Is that, is that everything? Yeah. So then we got this ghosty paws mystery. No, it's not. It's not all. Really? Okay, put that stuff in. Catch it. Catch. No, catch it. We'll do it together. Oh, push it down. Sorry, it's windy. We're moving somewhere. Okay, I got this ghosty paw. This is a ghosty paw. It's a mystic North Cozy Mysteries, USA. Today, best selling author. Okay, show them the picture. So that looks cool. Just read them like. Love just, just that little bit. Ghost cats and curtain. Kirkley small town characters filled this cozy mystery sprinkle. What? Sprinkled? Yeah, sprinkled. With magic and a little romance. Middle age can be murder. At least this, that's how it seems for former criminal journalist Willem Walla Lama Chance, who choose, who's near fatal accident has given her a strange side effect that sees ghosts after a messy divorce sent, sends her fleeing back to her hometown of mystic 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 notch nestled in the white mountains of new hamster willa finds herself haunted by the tenacious tenacious ghost of the town librarian who says willa solve her murder Lucky, she has lots of help, including a quirky small of a cast of a small town characters. The cat she intimidated from her grandmother and her best friend Pepper, who claims her herbal teas can work magic. But just when Willa thinks she can discover who the killer is, she finds out that things are not what they seem. It's Mystic Notch, and the cases take a strange turn that has Willa adding even some of her longtime friends to her sub. Suspect, suspect list. Can Willa suspect, suspect, list. suspect, whatever list. Can Willa find the real killer in time to keep the magical balance in mis mis mystic? Really notch in video. On the on the side of good, or will even will evil prevent? Whatever. Sorry, guys. There was no construction work at all. I don't know where. They're why all of a sudden there's all this racket so i apologize if it's too much noise we'll have to redo it so the next book is by lillian jackson braun it's called the cat who could read backwards it looks really cute it's actually a uh, bigger word so anybody who has needs the bigger words is bigger so it says same with this book yeah that's good it says upbeat prose and amiable characters the world of modern art is a mystery to many, but for Jim Corellan, it turns into a mystery of another sort. When his assignment to cover the art beat for the Daily Fluxion leads down the path to murder, a stabbing, a stabbing in an art gallery, vandalized paintings, a fatal fall from a scaffolding. This is not at all what Corellan expects when he turns his reportals talents to art. But now Quillerin and his newfound partner, Coco, the brilliant Siamese, are back in their elements, sniffing out clues and confounding criminals intent on mayhem and murder. The mix of crime and cats is catnip to readers who like bulbs. So it says there's more than 20 million cats who books and print. And you got your little uh, paws. So that's pretty cool. I guess it's going to be um, my book people fighting crime with a cat so those are real oh this one has a cat in it too so there you go so that's gonna be awesome they're cat books awesome awesome so our last and final thing oh sorry guys I'm losing everything 
And the last final thing is our treats. I told you to grab a sweater. Treat. So, you can tell what that is. It's a ginger tooth. So, original flavor. I'm, I don't, I won't try it because I don't like ginger. Well, it's really good for you. And there's some espresso candy. So, I like that. she'll uh, be humming on some espresso. And there's another one. This is um, Show them. classic series, and it's either Japanese or Korean, or just, um, Chinese, I don't know which one. So, as you can see, we got all kinds of those ones, and then I will give Kaylee the last one that, oh! This is mine! No, you gotta share it. You won't like it. Don't matter, you gotta share it. It's a Kit Kat that, in another language. That's okay, what is it? So, it's, it's green, what does it say? You can try it. So we're gonna try the Kit Kat. It's green. Oh, oh I know what this is. And I think cool. this is green tea. So while you're trying that, I'm gonna go through this. So this is the deluxe box. Uh, it got murder at Archley Manor and oh no, it's green tea. We have these here. Okay, so no, it's not the deluxe box. It's the normal box. Um. The only thing, uh, tea, so the tea is Clementine Sunset, uh, rock sugar, two ounce gold flat tin container with screw top cover, so that's, candy? This is candy, so I'm gonna try just, I wanna try, a small one, did you eat that? I Show like them, it. what? It's tea, it's green tea, so here's, I've had it before, here's those rock candies, can't you like, like it? So, and so the candle is Jovian Rose, a 4.5 glass jar with a flat glass lid. Is there a lid on it? It's a candle. It says there's a lid, but there's no, there's no lid. Check in that box. Check in that paper to make sure there's no lid. I'm feeling. Yeah, give me that cover. Right back. So, um, I'm not sure the lid's not there, but that's okay. It's lunch time to go. Um, this is alien fruit soap. Um, and it says bath bomb. Plutonium plut, plut, mist. So, um, oh, I guess I could have read just, it gives the book summaries here. Um. This other one was in the deluxe, and then you get an audiobook in the deluxe. So, um, those books aren't ours, actually. So I'm not quite sure. Um, my, there's one book here of mine, but not the other one. So I'm not quite sure, but that's okay. Um, so it says, so T. Clementine Sunset is Jasmine Pearl.